years ago, we were asked to join a small group of uh, or a team of companies under the leadership of Neptec uh, Design Group uh, to develop a lunar rover or to join in the development of rovers. And um, this uh, three-year work has uh, come to fruition and we have a very good announcement today. And I'll ask uh, Harold to come up and uh, make the announcement. Thank you very much, Harold. There was one item in Canada's economic action plan, though, that has received very little attention, in the Waterloo region at least. $110 million over three years was given to the Canadian Space Agency. I'm thrilled and humbled to formally announce today that an ODG, Ontario Driving Gear, is part of the NetTech Design Group, has moved on to the next round in development of the Lunar Rover Project, which we see behind us here. Two fully functional prototypes will be built, and ODG technologies were key to NEPTEC's success. I own an Argo. I've owned it for almost 18 years, and I've found that it's up to any challenge. I've had it working in the bush, pulling out logs, I've had it in the lake, my kids, sort of from the North Pole to Antarctica, from swamps to deserts, from mountains to sea, these guys have done it. And now after almost 40 years of building utility vehicles for the most hostile environments on Earth, ODG is looking beyond our planet for new challenges. The advances ODG makes in developing the lunar rover will transfer to other products. Like Canada, Ontario Drive and Gear will emerge stronger. Uh, in my opinion, a uh, nation wants to be wants to play along the, the leading nations in technology and wants to claim a leadership there also needs a credible presence in space. And for example, this rover technology we are developing now could be the next uh, signature technology Canada will be known for. The Waterloo region's got such a great reputation around the world on so many fronts, and uh, the fact that we are uh, potentially in space, we are in space already through, through cameras and through other technology, and it's great that uh, the Ontario Driving Gear is, is uh, one of those uh, very successful companies that is keeping us on the leading edge. We'll now uh, ask Harold to try out uh, our rover prototype. There's been a lot of work going on the last couple of years that got us to this point. What you see here is not the rover we're going to develop for the CSA. This is one we've already developed. The, the rover that we're going to build over the next two years is going to be much larger, and it's going to be a little bit larger than the Argo. 